I'm going to show you a short practice because that's all kiddos really give me um, of ways to open up your shoulders. This is good for postpartum after you've been pregnant for so long and your belly's pulling you forward now that your boobs have grown with a lot more milk and can around the kid or kiddos. Um, it's also great if you have an office job or just some poor posture. <laughs> um, so just let's have a seat wherever it's comfortable and we'll get going. We'll start great by grounding. Let's take a deep breath together in. Exhale out. And begin to breathe in and out of your nose. And I'll turn to the side for better demonstration. So just place your hands behind your fingertips towards your bottom. Squeeze your shoulder blades together and look up slightly. Deep inhale in. Mm -hmm. And then we'll just do a couple seated cat cows door up the spine. Inhaling forward, exhaling rounding back. Inhale forward, looking up. Exhale, looking down. Inhale, squeezing shoulder blades together, look up. Exhale, rounding and pulling shoulder blades apart. Come to neutral spine, and then well, one of my favorites is puppy pose. So from hands and knees, you begin to slide your hands forward, bringing your chest towards the ground, and then your chin towards it. <coughs> Press the tops of your feet into the ground or your mat. We'll inhale and begin to walk up. <laughs> Come to sit on your knees. Or, yeah, yeah, on your legs, shins. Clasp your hands behind you. And you can start to straighten your arms, squeezing those shoulder blades together. You can stay here. <laughs> or you can begin to fall forward into a child's pose. You can leave your um, hands at your hips or begin to open up. <laughs> Lower your hands if they're up. Release your grip. And inhale, roll up. Hi. <laughs> and then we'll come to lay on our back. Whoa! She wants to be a little skateboarder. Be careful, I don't want you to drop that on you. And then, so with your back, laying on your back, we'll come into fish pose. So, begin to sl let me remove my clip. Begin to slide your chest up, coming onto your head. You can press in your palms down into the ground and looking behind you, opening that chest up. So deep breath in here. And exhale, slide and release. While we're here, we'll just come into a short shavasana as we wind down before my kiddos start getting a little too upset and wild. Close your eyes. Let your palms open up towards the sky. Let your feet fly open. Take a couple breaths here. And you can stay in this position for a few breaths. And take as long as you need to relax. Focusing on, focusing on the sensations of your body.
And whenever you're ready, you begin to yeah. wiggle the fingers and toes. Uh, uh, uh. Ow, no thank you, that hurts. Yeah. Come to the side for just a moment. And slowly push yourself up. <laughs> to a comfortable seat. Gather all the energy you created around you. Bring your hands to heart center. Thank you for taking this time to practice with me. I hope this really tiny um, flow helps open up your chest and your heart a little bit. Namaste.